Hello and welcome back to Hearts Vine 4. Today we are playing as the United States. And Germany has 5.76 million losses. Which explains why the Axis are kind of losing. And Japan's got 1.23 million. And very few divisions left. Germany's got a ton. Britain's got less, but they're losses are not even close Australia and New Zealand have lost a lot we have lost 302,000 Greece has lost more than us and Australia has lost more than us also who's got participation see Britain's got 57 percent we only got 20 percent let's change that shall we so there's low supplies here. Really? Okay, I can see why. Okay, army. You. Let's see. Which area is the those two got it. So, Garrison. Wait, no, cancel. Garrison. Not here. Not here. Not here. Garrison there. There, there. Just there. For now. Once we get 50k over here, we wouldn't go to war. Eisenhower will lead this army. But for now, exercise. Get rid of those greens. And then we will invade. Soon. But not yet. So, go to the Pacific. The Pacific's not ready yet. They will be soon. More materials. What do we need? Oh my god. We need a lot. No, we're done with Britain. For now, anyway. Here, yeah, Britain's okay. They got plenty of that left. Okay. So what are constructions doing? Yeah, that. We're working on those as well. Slowly. Actually, not at all. It's because all the trade we have to do. Romania's capitulated. Wait, if they've capitulated... Uh-oh. Okay, D-Day. Yeah, let's do it express. Jeez, we need so many. Okay. Now. It's all because we're producing a crap ton of heavy SP artillery and mechs. Lots of mechs. <laughs> but seeing how the UK is moving in here and there. Okay. This war is going to be over quick. Alright, Blitzkrieg time. Even though we're not Blitzkriegers. So stop doing that. Okay. Select all of you. We did a naval invasion. Now this is only an idea. So for Normandy invasion, 
I mean, there's five beaches. One, two, three. Uh, that would be six. Yeah, three, four, five. Yeah. So, we'll go everywhere except here, I guess. Now, we won't go to this port. We'll go to that port. Okay, we'll go to that port. We won't go to that port. We'll come later. So, if we said here, here, how long would that take? It's 135 days. How about now? We'll pick the first 10. Ten. In the front line. You ten. We'll go from here. And you will land here. So not there. Start over. To here. That takes 35 days, okay. And we'll get the next 10. Which will go from here to here. Next ten. We'll go from here the next ten. Okay, these ten will go from here to here. Then everybody else these ten will go from here. There we go. And that'll take 35 days. And now, back to the Pacific. Those guys are setting up. Hungary's capitulated. Just waiting. And go. Let's go get back to Guam. That's an American territory. Boom. And these ten. Get Guam. Go, go, go. And boom. So what's the naval base situation? One. One. Oh well. To you go to Ujima.
you. Go take whatever that island is. This island. Marcus Island. And we have navy here, right? Correct. Okay, then. Just do your thing. It's gonna take too long. What does that say? What? Fifteen, okay. And this one, fifteen, okay. So, that'll take 52 days. Let's go here. It's launching quickly. Yep, most of our divisions are coming there. In fact, there's only one left that we're waiting on. Okay. That replaced the Cleveland class. The Cleveland class. Like Cruiser. Fargo. We need chromium. Of course we do. Civilian factories. Damn. They are important. 27 days. It's out of 35. How are the British doing? Okay, good. They're losing. But it shows there's very few Germans here. Oh, we can push so fast. All right, D-Day. That's right. March 6th, 1945 is D-Day. The largest naval invasion ever um, attempted in history. Honestly, I don't really care what tech we research right now. I'm not even going to replace the navies anymore. There's really no reason to. Boom. Oh. oh, yeah? D-Day successful. Delete all those. Okay. First things first. Go take Paris. And then... No. Take Paris. Then, close to the German border. And go. And yeah, be aggressive. Also, who's this guy? Oh, those guys. You. Ooh. Guess what, Germans? Don't sit comfy yet. These troops are finally going to be on the move. Let's go like that. You guys stay like that, okay. Go, go, go. All 
Oh yeah, we're pushing in. Mechanized for the win. And non-mechs for the win. Oh, okay. Yeah, you know what to do. I'll take you. You go do that. Yeah, obviously. Oh, France and Communists. That's why it's called the French Commune. Yeah, see, they're going slow on purpose. Yeah, take that out. Boom. So, what's our score right now? 33 already. Brings up 49. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? Yeah, we'll keep making convoys. Goodbye. Goodbye. Screw the Navy. We don't need it anymore. We got big enough navy. Okay. And we'll reduce the water we need. Reduce our alliance in South Africa there. There we go. No. Like that. Oh, wow. These Germans, they have no chance. Go there. France is nearly liberated. We're just blowing through this. Of course. Always need resources. They should automate that. They really should. Yeah, we're gonna take them out of Bordeaux. All these victory points are ours. Boom. Yeah. Go get Toulouse. That should end the war for Vinci. Let's see. If not, you. Yep, go by Vinci France. You have some of those Spains in the war, right? Let's check. 
Because if they are... Oh, they are. And... Okay, you finish that first. I mean, it's obvious we're going to win. Here. You guys. All right. Didn't create a new front line. Wait, what is with that? In this front line. It's, yeah, like that. And go. No, oh, all you guys. There. 20 divisions. Go take out Spain. Nuclear bombs. Allow nuclear bombs. Boom. And they're done, too. 73 days. Nice. Go. 